Yeah, I'm back, everybody. I just had to walk over here again. I kind of thought I had to do a whole bunch of shit, but I did not have to do a whole bunch of shit, so it's all good. I didn't get to talk to Jerry again, unfortunately. I'd probably go back and do a little battle with him. All right, they assault me, dude. Like, how's that fucking? How's that nice in any way? Let's do her again. Roll around, roll around in dirt and snow. I smell like a weird puppy. Oh, what the? That's not all that bad. Well, you should smell me, everyone. Sniff you again. I've been rolling in the dirt. You smell all right. It smells like I'm actually a little puppy, dude. You just couldn't tell, cause you know I'm a humane. I'd be a lost puppy. I am a lost puppy, dude. Rolling in the dirt and snow again. You smell like a weird puppy. Number two, Snuzzle Champions, 96. I like this attack better. Damn, why couldn't I just go with this one? So the other fucking double axe death. <clears throat> Resniff me. The dogs already know you smell fine. It smells like a. What should I do? Just wait it out? I mean, I might not even give a shit to be honest. Alright. A spare. Don't touch my hot dog. Oh my Jesus Christ. Alright. You pet the doggo. What about me? Dog pets. A dog that pets dogs. Amazing. A very auspicious thing to say. Ah, my holy goddamn. Alright, they seem to be practicing for the next couple's contest. I can see with their multiple kissing. Literally, multiple kissing. You pet dog me. Wow, pet by another pup. Oh, don't leave me out. Ah, how easy this one is. The dog's minds have been expanded. Ah, oh, thank god. Look at their eyes. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has been opened up for us. <laughs> Thanks, weird puppy. It's cool, I guess, man. Smell like absolute ass though now, but hell. Look at this crazy ass pulse. I didn't even read this. Oh, I didn't read this line. Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. Oh, then press the switch. Why would you tell me how to do the puzzle? How does that make any sense? Uh oh, shit. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? Let me tell the about the spaghetti. I, um... I left it. Really? Wowie! You resisted the flavor of my home-cooked pasta, just so you could share it with me. Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you can ever want. <laughs> what? I don't understand. Like, <laughs> you're gonna I'm gonna bring you into custody, but I kind of want to be your best pal. Like, make up your mind, mate. Shit. Oh, he wants to talk. My brother started a stock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he could do without such a cool guy taking care of him. I actually wonder the same thing, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, uh... Sorry, do you want me to solve this other puzzle? I didn't even... I started a sock collection recently. It's all the sad thing. Alright. Oh, shit, dang. Human! Uh, 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 how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground now the solution is different, and as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere to be found. I suppose what I'm saying is, worry not, human. I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give it away the answer. Reaction to an O and press the switch. I believe there's a very specific area you had to walk through to, to do this. I believe it was just this. If I'm correct, or... No, I think I remember what it was. Um...
Oops. Oh, apparently we can make things into a triangle. Yeah, okay. I know I knew it was something like this. Shabam, dude. Wow, you solved it! <laughs> you did it all about my help! Incredible! I'm impressed! You must care about puzzles like I do! Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, fucking sons, dude. Don't just appear out of, like, thin air like that. Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help, which is great. Because I love doing absolutely nothing. Good job on solving Okay. Alright, yeah, whatever. Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great pup Dr. Alpheus. And you see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will, uh, <laughs> electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you'll have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They make you smell delicious. <laughs> Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but... You'll smell like oranges. Again, like oranges. The piranhas will bite you. Oh, okay. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Jesus Christ. Purple tiles are slippery. You'll slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? Understand the explanation? Yeah. Sure. Fuck it, right? Uh. Great! And there's still- uh, And then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. But not even I will know the solution. Yeah! <laughs> Get ready. Here we go. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god! Nice. Alright, hey, that was a pretty difficult puzzle. The machine isn't working. <laughs> Figured. Actually, that's what we got it from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> That's sad, dude. Hey, a doggo! This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. I don't know if I could blame him. I'd, I'd do that. Knowing that that dog will never give up trying to make perfect snow dog, it fills you with that sexy determination. Uh, so who's here? On the floor besides a box of Pomeranz- Pomeranz- Pomeranians, fuck me. Aware of dog, please pet dog. It's just a box of Pomer- Pomer raisins. Pomer raisins. Pomer raisins. I thought I said Pomeranians. Stay blank into the snow. Uh, okay then. Yo, look at this- look at this chill guy, dude. The dog considers himself- uh, it considers itself an artist, but doesn't ever do. Uh, 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 oh my God! But doesn't ever know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. That's pretty rude, mate. You fucking cunt lord. But I kind of have to agree with you there. Oh my cannoli! Oh shit! What the hell? It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the words hands written on a red marker. <laughs> okay. Yeah.
Sweet. Okay, I love the music. Oh, I'm just sliding right through. Oh, it's ice, that's why. Oh. Let's go back again, dude. It's a l oh, it's like a little snow house on my head. Ah, oh, dude, I wanted to keep the snow house. Okay, it's a lump now. Is it a snow house again? It's a dog! <laughs> Alright, let's see what else we can find. Don't be a lump of snow. Oh, it's a little snow bird parrot thing. What's it now? Ah, uh, lump of snow. Alright, I think that's it. Me. Yep, lump of snow. Oh, well, yeah, let's get on this way. <clears throat> What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> I don't know what's up. Don't just say what's up and then not say anything. What the? Christ. What is his name? Uh, Griff, Griff Trot comforts you. Oh, he, com he confronts me and it comforts me. Let's undecorate him. You remove a stocking filled with chicken nuggets. Chicken fucking nuggets. That's a little better. Hey, 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 hey! Holy cannoli! That's some real bullet hell now. Well, pretty easy. He's slightly less irritated. Very less. Oh, here, I removed the barbed wire made of pipe cleaners. That's a little better as well. Hey, 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 whoa, whoa, pal. Back it up. Back it up. So, okay. <clears throat> I move a box of non dog related raisins. The weight has been lifted. Trying to decorate? Question mark? Or er, those are real. Give him a gift. I gave him 35G because you can't think of an appropriate gift. Aw, oh, you shouldn't have. His brother's been taken away. Let's give him a gift. Not hey now. You weren't made of money. Oh, you shouldn't have. All right. Some the uh, some teens decorated it as <laughs> as a prank. Thanks. Hey, nope. No problems, man. I, see, I got no problems, dude. I even gave him a little present, dude. Gave him 35 gold. I don't know how good I feel about that, but... Wait, hold on. Are you over... Oh my god, this is some double mind fucking shit right here. Are you lost? Not lost. Not lost. Stop. Give me the eye look, bastard. How are you... How are you doing this? What the fuck? Bastard. Are you sure, uh, you sure don't like to exercise? <laughs> you, uh, you sure don't like to exercise? Oh my god, what are you doing? Are you lost? Wait, I, I don't understand. Yeah, 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 you goddamn teleporting bastard. He just teleports in front of me. There's a house down there. Hmm. Ah, uh, man, I want to go to that house now, though. Mm -hmm. It's a door. There's only so many combinations, so... Can you open that door? Is that something you can do? I just don't know. Say, are you following me? No, I'm not following you. Bastard. I just like to exercise. <coughs> this is bullshit. I want in. Damn it. Oh. Hey, he's popped up again. Alright, let's undecorate you some more stuff. 
Uh, you remove the striped cane that says, I use this tiny cane to walk on it. Uh-oh, 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 oh, oh my god! Why are you doing this? So you read the box and not do it. Ha! God damn! Bookmark of a smug teen winking. Ah, uh, no problem. Oh, can I can I enter this little cavern here? There must be some sort of little something I could do here about this. Surely there's something I gotta do here. Though. Hmm. I want to do a little bit of research on this real fast. Hope nobody minds if I just quickly look this up for a second. Uh. I want to see if there's um anything talking about that. I'm kind of interested in that. Uh, in case just ask this size if you left for all this, uh, you can interact with it. Let's say, let's go. Yeah, we'll fit later in the plot. Uh, we could do it. Okay. I'll say that too. I wonder if there's any relevance to the door. I don't think there is anything to that door. There's a secret book going mushrooms and, and other rooms further into the game, but not very far at all, both which have four mushrooms in each group as well. I've only found two groups since I finished the game. I haven't finished the game yet, so I have no clue if there is more. <clears throat> but it's a safe assumption that is related. May not be though. <laughs> uh, I messed with it a bit as well. I could have found nothing happened. It looks exactly like the tutorial was going to destroy it, so I could assume it leads back into the ruins. The floating dots make different sounds depending on the ones you touch. Also, the symbol on the door's tutorial symbol makes this what it will. It says, You better off forgetting about that door. It'll only lead you to despair in another post. Uh, the plot thickens. I keep playing. Huh. You know what? You know what this probably is. It's probably a um, a debug room. Does it make different sounds? It could be a debug room where you have to do a sequence in a very specific manner, and if you don't do the sequence white, uh, white. If you don't do the sequence right, you won't be able to access the room. Uh, I mean, it could be a debug room. Like, like if you ever played Fallout 3, there's a um, room you can go to that will allow you to. Uh, it, it's in. It's like later on in the game where you go into this place called Tranquility Lane. Once you go there. There's a little thing you can do if you play a certain selection of music or a very, very specific thing of uh, sounds or so, uh, whatever, you will open up like some kind of uh, console command. You can make some Chinese invasion happen. Uh, I don't know. It's weird. Uh, it does. I hate the game. It's, it's, a, it's a pup playing in the game. It's like the sounds more. I thought it, I got the true end, but I don't remember him talking about that door. Okay, about the one you go through, but I know something. Uh, if you didn't take Sans up on his two offers to go to the bar slash restaurant, you may have missed the bits where he talks about the door. Uh, okay, I'm not sure if it had to do with the never dying up till then, but the MTT Hotel, when Sans offers to hang with you, he explains that he found a door near Snowden that he tells a story about. Uh, I'm not sure if it opens the door or if you open a little, but it's a sad story all the same. And I'm going to be playing through blah 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 blah. Uh, the door Sam's talking about is actually the one you exit, uh, the one you exit uh, the ruins from yourself when meeting him. Calling Papyrus outside, it confirms this. Okay. Who said something called uh, idiot for uh, to open a door? Who said something called somebody for turns out that this situation was right. When Fred on that website was however I don't know. 
Oh my god, everybody has no idea. The website has a four uh, for the uh, sources. Do not touch the names during the extra credits. Really? How do you get the true names? Huh. I said it's one of the four leaf clovers. Yeah, okay. Uh, I haven't been the game yet, but open, but open to spoilers. So I'm glad I saw this morning first. Okay. Uh, saying the names are in the credits. Oh, wow. Is that even humanly possible? I can't see Toby meant by saying that. Trying to open a door will only lead you to despair. Uh, okay. Man, there's so much more like, what? No one knows how to open the fucking door. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> All right. Oh, well. I, I did a whole bunch, right? I'm going to probably end the episode here for right now. I'm actually reached the limit. Sorry, I wasted your, like, this whole segment of just trying to figure out how to open this stupid fucking door. But anyway, I'm going to end it here. Read some more shit, I guess, and see if I can figure anything out. I'm kind of interested. I don't want to leave anything out. You know what I mean? But anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching this episode, and I will catch you guys next time. Peace!